Hello everybody, welcome to another Screwy Tuesday. Uh, this is going to be a real short one. Uh, an update with myself. Uh, I had a little health issue. I had kidney stones. Yeah, one in each kidney, two millimeters in each kidney, and then I had a three millimeter in one of the uh, tubes, or one of the pipes coming down. So last Thursday I had, uh, they call it surgery, where they put you out, they go in, shoot the one in the pipe with a laser, and then sonic the other two, and uh, today's Monday, uh, three o'clock in the afternoon, and I finally got out of bed and showered and shaved, but it's been a hell since Thursday, and slowly on the mend. Um, tomorrow, if you hear uh, howling at about four o'clock, it's not Howie, it's me. I have a stint in there, and they're going to pull the stint tomorrow. And I'm uh, not looking forward to that, but uh, uh, you got to do what you got to do. So this is going to be a real short one, uh, uh, and I've called this video Flea Market Dave. Uh, my good buddy Flea Market Dave uh, has been on a little bit of a buying spree um, and uh, I wanted to share that with you. He's a great friend. Uh, I have a lot of, we talk almost every day and really enjoy each other. Uh, a lot of guys met him at the bash. Um, so before we flip to that, uh, I just want to talk about one other thing. This morning, uh, it's thir it was 31 degrees here in the Bay Area, California, and uh, we, uh, the ants, we typically get an ant attack in the summer when uh, things are dry and they're looking for water and then in the winter they, they come in and we just had some rain and they decided to attack in forces uh, uh, over the night. It looked like the LA freeway, there were so many of them. So my wife hates the smell of raid so we found that uh, Pam is a great uh, insecticide. <laughs> you, you use it on our cooking all the time. And I tried it in the kitchen one day uh, when they were in there in the summer and uh, it's not poisonous and you can spray them and it kills them instantly and then it's a simple clean up and wipe up. Uh, so uh, Pam, uh, if you got some ants and you need something uh, non-toxic to spray, simple cleanup, try Pam, worked well. So I thought I'd share that tip. Uh, in talking about that, my buddy Flea Market Dave uh, mentioned that just mixing uh, like Dawn dishwater soap dishwashing soap with water in a spray bottle will basically do the same thing. The soap, I guess, smothers, smothers them also. So, uh, enough said. I don't know if you can read it, but Merry Christmas to all. Happy holidays to all. I uh, hope everybody has a, a good holiday, and we'll look at seeing you next uh, Screwy Tuesday. Um, so let's talk about uh, my buddy Flea Market Dave. Uh, this first photograph, uh, he... Uh, He's quite a collector of uh, various tooling and tools. Um, and he sent me a picture the other day. He had just finished restoring his large Wilton Vice. And for fun, he uh, sent me a picture of the Wilton Vice restored with the uh, baby Wilton sitting on top of it. It's a cool photo, so uh, let's click to that. Uh, then Dave sent me another photo. Um, he ended up picking up a uh, Coolmate, Miller Coolmate, for his TIG welder and uh, got a good buy on it and uh, it's really super shape. Uh, here's a photo of that. And uh, when he sent me the photo, he says, uh, I'm done buying tools. And so it will happen just the next morning. Um, I was uh, perusing Craigslist and up in San Francisco was a uh, five by 10 or two acorn tables together, welding tables um, on a, just a bitch and stand. Um, and it's, the acorn uh, surface was ground. I looked at that and I got a hold of Dave at his job and said, Dave, uh, get on Craigslist. I said, you're not done buying tools. Uh, I knew this was something he was looking for and uh, he got a great buy on it. And uh, I'm gonna go help him move it here in another week and a half or so. But uh, we'll finish up with the photos of uh, the acorn table there. 
and uh, congratulations to my buddy Dave. I'm like, really excited for him. It's it's a hell of a piece. He's currently uh, in the plans of building his uh, shop uh, at his property. Uh, it's probably his time off, so he's got to store this table, but uh, he's going to have a heck of a shop once he gets it built. All right, see you guys uh, next Screwy Tuesday. Again, have a great holiday. Uh, thanks for uh, all the support over this last year, and uh, see you next week.